what's up guys and welcome back to a new video on the channel of by me baron tour yes i'm back from the video on this channel in today's video then it is Pete speaking about Pete Wells' plans ahead of the January transfer window. But before we do get any further into the video, then please don't forget to smash like, subscribe to the channel, turn that notification bell on to be notified when I do upload the video. Also, let's try and get 10 likes at least on this video. It'd be massively appreciated. And let's get into speaking about Pete Wells' January transfer window plans. So then, Pete Wilder has discussed his transfer window plans for the January transfer window. BBC Radio Cumbria spoke to him and he said, well, he would like to bring in a few more uh, forward players with the style of play that we play. He also wants to bring in a, another number 10 that is a bit more... A bit more free free roam if you get what I mean so he's more of a, a playmaker sort of player because with us now sitting up in the fourth it, we want to break teams down it's harder to break teams down uh, because they're respecting us also he wants to he wants to improve on the fence or on the back line like bringing in more strength into the back line I agree with the back line sort of the sort of thing with maybe bringing in a new centre half just with we're just lacking a bit of depth in that centre half position, and also another with the back line. I think we maybe need a new keeper. Paul Farman. He's just he just costs us a lot of games. Like he he has some good games, and then he goes and have some bad bad games. It's just inconsistency from Paul Farman, and it needs to stop. So I think another goalkeeper would be an option that. Uh, Pete Wow needs to bring in, but I'm just going to see if there's any more. I'm just going to hear if there is any more things that he does say throughout this uh, BBC Radio BBC Radio Cumbria thing that I uh, that he's uh, said, and I'll be back with you if there's any more updates. So then another thing that he said, the well on the, the well on the way. They know what sort of players that they want to bring in to the club. The 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 they think that the we might have all the deals done that he said by midnight on New Year's Day when the op when the window is open. He, he he's saying that all of the deals should be done by then, but you never know. Agents could cut agents and stuff like that. They could they could they could muck it up the uh, the deal and stuff like that. It's not the correct agreement between the clubs and the agents and the players that we're trying to bring in. But there haven't been any rumours. Or players that have been linked with the club yet, so it'd be interesting to see what sort of players that Wild has been looking at. I know we've still got them connections with the United, with them through Manchester United players that were came down for a few training sessions. So I don't know if any, if there's any interest in that. But I wouldn't mind a few Manchester United academy players, maybe on like a loan or something like that. But it, it I just. I'll be interested to see what sort of signings they are, but yeah, I definitely agree. We need a centre. We need improvements on the back line. Maybe a maybe a creative number ten. But Billy Waters is doing amazing there. I can't fault him. Same with Robbie Gotts when he he's been playing. I can't fault him in that number ten role. But I just think another uh, just a experienced league to creative player. If you get what I mean, but. That's all I'm going to speak about in, in this video. It's just an update of the plans of the January transfer, what Pete Wilde's plans are for this upcoming transfer window. If you have enjoyed this, then it's, it's a return. It's, it's a short video, but I'll be back with some more. If you have enjoyed this one, you know what to do. Smash a like, subscribe to the channel, turn the notification bell on to be notified every single time I post a new video. And I'll see you for another one very, very soon.